YouTube, what is up guys? Uh, I have a box of a, oh no, what is this? This is a YouTube channel. Welcome back to the Power Nine Quest. My name is Andy and this is a box of collector's boosters from the new magic set Ikoria, Layer of Behemoths. Last time I said that I said I, Bahamas. I back either way. You know what? Layer of apples. Call it that. I don't care. Uh, but yeah, this is a super fun set. Really fun box to open. Um, and I got a few of them at release. I opened up one for fun last night, and I'm doing one for you guys right here. So uh, you, it's like it's stupid how many like mythics and fancy cards you get in one of these boxes. So uh, let's just let's experience it. Let's see if we can pull some good stuff. And that's it. Let's have fun and hang out and open up magic cards. All right, Ikoria, layer of the pineapples. Let's do this. 12 packs of some fancy, shiny things. Uh, yeah, actually, you know what? I opened up, let's let's do the history real fast. I opened up three boxes, one for you guys, two for just casually myself, like a month ago. And, um, gosh, I love it. It is kind of cool. You know what? I feel like when I film this and I'm looking at my phone, I, I appreciate some of these, uh, the, the foils in... And then if I just looked at it with my eyeballs, that's probably not a real thing, but maybe I just pay closer attention when I'm filming for YouTube. Um, so, the, yeah, yeah, the history. Uh, oh, we're in here. There's our commander card. There's a commander stack. We've got Azerta, the Dawn Waker, extended art. Uh, I think I called this Slither Whisper. Uh, uh, it's a Slither Wisp, the one I pulled it the other time. Um, I pulled... Those boxes were phenomenal. The first three boxes that I got, they were really, really good. And then uh, I have, I did one last night. Um, oh, there's some, I did one last night. You know what, we're just gonna put that in the whatever stack. Uh, oh, there you go, Katria Triome. Um, why, why did we not call these Trilands? Like we've been calling dual lands, dual lands for like the dawn of time. Why aren't these called Trilands? Is that a thing? Am I, if I'm a, an idiot, if, there, and if there's a reason, let me know. Um, we'll put that in the extended art. Um, oh, but it looks like we got some extra. Nice. Cub Warden. Dude, this is Cub Warden. I, I don't know what... It, I've been staring at this card for over a month now, and like just from pulling it and seeing it, and I had no idea that was called Cub Warden. Dude, my brain doesn't pay attention to things. Uh, so the first two boxes were fantastic. Like, it didn't make sense. I was like, there are way too many amazing cards and mythics and box toppers uh, in this. And then the, the box last night that I did was actually kind of tame. So it kind of made, made me feel hopeful about this one being entertaining for you guys. Uh, but yeah, I didn't know what was going on at, uh, at, at Wizards when they're making this. They're like, uh, hey, how, how do you want to change the collector's boosters? Like, I don't know, maybe we should just have the attitude that you get a mythic and you get a mythic and I get a mythic and she gets a mythic. Because it's crazy. Like everyone gets box toppers, everyone gets mythics. Um, you know what, I know that's, uh, any commander cards going there is what I'm trying to say. Uh, the Ozolith Extended Art. I, this video is going to be... Uh, oh, the I Wish I Was King Kong. Rare. Uh, this video is going to be a million years long if I don't keep going. Okay. Got the nice... Uh, this art is so rad. I mean, all of this. the Like, the, that style. Like, that style right there. Hey, cool. We got another Extended Art because why not? Uh, another Extended Art. Why not? Uh, that's the Godzilla pile. Bulbakeet. And that is it for that pack. You know what? I started talking about how everyone gets all these mythics and everything. I haven't even pulled a mythic yet. This box is like, hey, hold my drink. I'm gonna make this guy look stupid. Okay. Uh, honey Mammoth. Uh, Swift Water Cliffs. Or Swift, Swift Water Cliffs. I like those dual ends that are just, that they come into play tapped. But actually, my favorite dual end is, are the ones that, like, if you have, like, if you own a planar swamp, this does not come into play tapped. And it's just a regular dual end. That's awesome. But I also like the ones that just, you just gain life. Um, uh, oh, Mythic. Uh, Mythic Commander right there, uh, Jirina Kudro, um, Dranith <laughs> Ma Magistrate. This guy is like hands down actually, like uh, after he got done posing for this artwork, he like he like put on, he stopped his magic hands and then he went and tried to sell someone like beard, beard oil or like shampoo for your beard. Oh, there we go. I pulled this box topper last night. Unpredictable Cyclone. Uh, we got a box topper stack and we just go through these. Oh, there we go. See, now now the mythics are starting to happen. Nethroi, Apex of Death. Mythic stack. And Gigan, Cybercall, Terror for the Godzilla card. Uh, which, uh, somebody said, like, the way you organize cards drives, is, gets to. I'm sorry. It's kind of hard, honestly, with when, when all of these different types. You're filming a YouTube video, and all of these different types of cards are flying at you. And you got to keep the thing moving. You got to keep talking. Uh, so, bear with me, people. 
Prickly Marmoset. Um, okay, ooh, that's a really cool artwork. Uh, I do love the, I don't know how people are, I swear I'm holding two cards right there. I don't know how people are like really, like I, I actually, I heard some people like just downright trash talking this set. Um, and I think it's fun. I like when sets have a very distinct vibe. I mean, they all have their distinct vibes, but this is like, I don't know. This is a really, I like this. Um, that's pretty cool. Babush, the Prey Piercer. Um, got comic book time. Uh, eight, there we go. See, these mythics are rolling in. Vadrock, Apex of Thunder. And we got another Caesar. And what is what is here? And then the, then that freaking angry moose that has like bonus antlers. All right, we need some big ones. Come on, I did do a, a just the the draft boosters, um, a box of that. And I one I love it that you can pull uh, like the extended arts and the showcases and stuff out of those packs. I've had actually pretty good luck uh, from the draft boosters that I've opened from this set. Um, but I love. Uh, but the box topper, it comes the box topper. And I totally got uh, the bio, bio plant dude, whatever his name is. Uh, maybe we'll pull him here in a second. I got that as the box topper for that. I'm like, dude, they, they really did some cool things with this set. And I think it's, I think it's really fun to open. Uh, it does look fun to play, but then I heard a lot of people, I saw some YouTube title, which is a stupid way to start any statement, but I saw some YouTube title saying that the companion mechanism is actually pretty lame. So I don't know. I haven't actually got to play with the new mechanics of the set yet. So let me know what you guys think. If you guys have actually got your hands dirty with it. Um, I, as I've said it before, I usually, I'm just waiting for those pre-constructed decks. Those are always fun. Boom, 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 dude. You know what? There's, there's certain things that are always going to be like, that's a cool graphic. And like, you know, the artist is like, what should I put on this card? Like, just make it a big eyeball. You're like, well, it's, it's supposed to be a squirrel, like eyeball, you know? And then... Sure enough, I don't even know what that card's called. I just looked at the artwork, and uh, it might be a squirrel. And it makes no sense that the human eyeball was looking at me, but there you go. Um, all right, Trin, Champion of Freedom. What a good, what, what a good name. Um, oh, here we go, Box Topper time. We got the ape. We got uh, Kahira, the Orphan Guard, Box Topper. Um, got some comic book time. We got more. Of course, the, the, the pack's not over. You're getting more priceless things. Look at this. What? Why is that there? That's amazing. Like, is that a box? I just got two box toppers in one in one box, and oh my gosh, that's what I'm saying. Like that, that's nuts. Godzilla stack, technically, technically three box toppers. What? These packs don't know what like. Is is that possible for like the the, the box to be this good, and like I mean, in the values of the cards to stay? It's insane. Oh my gosh. Okay, all right, let's keep going. We're like, I think, I think very right now, this is like the first, this is the first card, first pack of the second half of the box. Um, a shark. This sucks I couldn't get Jaws and just throw him in this set too. How, oh, there we go. See, foil mythic, Vedrock, a box of thunder. This is insanity. I'm putting you in the mythic stack. This is, honestly, it's kind of funny because, oh, dude. All right, so I got a foil, I got Jaws. I'm just saying that because it's a cool looking card. I got the, the, a foil mythic. An extended art mythic showcase. Uh, what, what do I even do with that? Mythic stack, right? And then I got Godzilla Doom Inevitable extended art. Like, bonkers. And I know he's not going in the Godzilla stack. This is just for the stuff I don't care about. That's <laughs> that's Godzilla. Uh, oh my gosh, this is such a fun box, though. I hope you guys are. I hope you guys are enjoying me uh, watching my insanity with this. Um, also, if you want to see more fun videos like this. Uh, hit the subscribe button, and that'll sign you up to see more. I would appreciate it. Um, I do do videos all the time. No, well, twice a week. Uh, twinning staff, and let's let's get rolling. We got the extended art, Umori the collector. We got uh, Genesis ultimatum, foil rare. We got some um, some stuff happening. Another extended art triome because those are in every pack. Ooh, we got a foil Godzilla, and you are going to the Godzilla stack because you are an uncommon. I, you know, I, the only, I guess I would, no, I'd probably put the Space Godzilla there too. Uh, I got three Space Godzillas in the box I opened up last night, which I said this, everyone's saying this, but I said this in my first like where I'm like, dude, that card's going to drop. And like, I got three. I got three of them. And I, I have yet to open a box that I do not get at least one. But maybe, maybe this is the box that it's like, hey, dude, I'm going to make you look stupid. Uh, ooh, Cryptic Trilobite. 
uh, another Genesis Ultimatum, Extended Art, uh, Foil Mythic, there's Luca, Copper Code Outcast, or what was that, the, the Champion of Freedom? I got a phone call, sorry. All right, I don't even know how phone calls came through. I'm in airplane mode. Uh, I hope I can sync this up correctly, easy. Um, all right, Cub Warden and Bi- Oh, cool, I haven't pulled him in a while. Dude, two, two mythics in this pack, too. Cub Warden, Extended Art, uh, and then Space Time, Godzilla, Ultimate Maximus. All right, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, la Layer of the Staplers is a, fan, is a very fun opening. Uh, we've got three packs left, people. Where are you, Spacey? Uh, oh, I thought that was a I thought that was a hedgehog at first. Is that just a cat that ran into a bush? If I would have read the read the cards a little bit, I probably could tell you. Um, one thing that's funny, I feel like everything's a, dino a dinosaur cat or a dinosaur or a cat in this. Like it makes sense for Godzilla to be a uh, and maybe and I, I maybe that's like some lore that I don't that I don't know. But if you yeah if you read uh, the Godzilla whatever the one I just pulled it probably says dinosaur cat. All right, there's another uh, extend. There's a box topper, box topper for you, box topper for him. Um, dude, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm not meaning to be spoiling that. These cards are sticking together. Gem razor, another, another two box toppers in one pack, dude. What was what was the Godzilla card? Oh, that was that. That was that box topper. So that's why, because you can get like the they're gonna be the box topper in the box topper slot, and then the Godzilla is is like the Godzilla card is just like a wild card, right? It can be a box topper. I don't know, but then why did I get that box topper in that the Triome? That's insane. All right, thank you for hanging out for my my random thoughts. Uh, extended art classification, rare foil. Uh, Narset of the Ancient Way. Another Godzilla Primeval Champion. Man, we're pulling him. All right, so here it is. This is the one Ikoria Collector's Booster Box that does not have Space Godzilla in it. Which, like I said, I pulled three last night, so I don't like. I don't need him. I don't need him in. And I, I am gonna keep a couple just because it's such an iconic card and there was such a hype around it. I'm gonna put it in my collection. I thought about just keeping all of the Godzillas, and making a Godzilla binder. It'd be kind of fun. All right. What will it be? Boneyard. That, uh, Death's Oasis, Extended Art, Mythos of Nethroi, and whoosh, Sea Dasher Octopus. That's another one I always pull. Ooh, wow! And a Mothra Extended Art at the close. That was a ton of fun. But, dude, let's... All right, I'm going to cut, and we'll, we'll, we'll count. When I'm looking through these piles, I'm like, why did I put this card there, of all places? Uh, so, all right, so... I got 10 Mythics, which is impressive, but that's kind of where Theros was, uh, Beyond Death. I do want to point out, though, that I got one if, if Extended Art Foil, that, you know, that's a, a box topper, right? And tell me, you guys can in, intellectualize me in the comments if what's not. But, like, Extended Art Foil, Extended Art Foil, are, do all these count as box toppers? And then, and then I got, like, three more in the Godzilla, so if those all count, it's nine. I got nine box toppers, technically. Including the uncommons and stuff. Uh, I don't know. It's just it's a crazy box like it's it's like a box on steroids It's like a magic box on steroids, uh, but not bad pools I could have pulled some better cards, but I didn't pull terrible cards and uh, it was a fun It was a fun time. So thank you guys for hanging out with me um, I hope you enjoyed it if you want to see more uh, magic old and new uh, other card games I do a bunch on here. So hit the subscribe button. And that's it. I'll be back. You guys have a fantastic day I hope everyone's happy and healthy out there Except people that park their car in four spaces for one car. That's a bit much. I still, I, get, I, 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 still, I hope you're healthy. But I hope you're slightly less happy than the rest of us. Because don't park your car in four places. You know, just pick up a spot in the back. Okay, another video done. Thank you guys for hanging out with me while I opened that box. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. And I will be back shortly with another video for you to watch or not watch. But it'll be there. And that's what's important. It's there. Or it will, it, it will be there. What am I even talking about? You guys have a good one. Goodbye.